Steph, you've got to stay here. It's too dangerous. Who knows what's out there? We've been out there for so long. Just us. Now we finally found survivors and shelter. We need this. I'm not proud about everything I've done, but we've been given a second chance and I'm not going to blow it for us. I'll bring back the mask. I'll find food. Everything will be fine. Don't worry, Steph. I'll be back before you know it. Another day in paradise, huh? Uh, just keeping a good look out, I guess. Three ambushes, two break-ins, two cuts and scrapes. I can't believe we're still kicking. Well, what's the damage report? Rations have been distributed. All the inventory is accounted for. The windows have been secured and barricaded. We're short on medical supplies, but fortunately, no injuries have been reported. Thank God. And Andrew is still out searching for supplies as of day 74. Do you know today would have been Carol's birthday? <sighs> Again, Leonard, I'm, I'm real sorry. If, if there's anything I can do Bradley, for you... Bradley, you've done enough already. All right? Just trying to do the best I can, sir. That son of a bitch better get his ass back here quick. I'm glad to see you and Andrew getting along so well. The guy tries to break in and steal from us. We can't just let him in with open arms. <laughs> What's he supposed to do, just leave him there? I'm just saying. Things would have been a lot different had I not been out scouting when all this happened. You took me in when everything went to hell. Yeah. That was before everybody went batshit crazy. I just don't see how you can see the best in people nowadays. Yeah, well, we're still alive, aren't we? Yeah. We'll see. These balloons aren't going anywhere without helium, right? Go away, Brad. I really don't want to talk right now. Ooh, sorry, I didn't know I was crashing the party. I'm just bored. There's nothing to do here. Leonard's not going to like you stealing from storage. It's a candy bar, Steph. It's your funeral. Just don't end up in the same boat I'm in. By that. Leonard hates me. Andrew, too. Yeah, he does it. Then why does Leonard want me gone if Andrew doesn't come back with a stinky ass mask? Yeah. Guess you probably leave the door closed. That's a private matter, stay private. How much did you hear? Leonard said that if Andrew doesn't come back with his precious gas mask, he'll get the boot or something. Yeah, something like that. Look, it's all hypothetical talk right now. <laughs> Fine, I'll just be hypothetically mad then. 
Does he really think Andrew would just leave me here? I, I wouldn't worry too much about it. It's not me who I'm worried about. Something on your mind, Bradley? You know, uh, you might not have to if Andrew ever decides to show up. Look, Leonard, I really appreciate what you've done for this group and for me, but I mean, don't you think this is going a little bit too far? Brad, we got one, 10, 11 people here. Losing this gas mask means limiting our supplies. It's gonna make it that much harder to feed more mouths with less than what we already have. So, you want me to just put a bullet in some girl's head just because we lost one? We should have been taking these precautions from the beginning. Everybody out there's become a goddamn maniac. I'm not taking any more chances. But why me? Andrew's not the only one I don't trust. Somebody's been picking at the uh, food supply without permission. You left the door open on the way out. You want that trust back? If not, you can go hang out with your bandit friend. Bradley will be here in just a minute. He's not coming. Neither is Andrew. Bradley, what the hell? Grab whatever's yours and let's go. Do this. Okay, look. I've drawn a map of possible locations where you can find shelter. You got some cans of food. I'm not leaving you here. I don't have time to argue with you about this. Well, what if Andrew comes back and he looks for I you? will tell him where you went. Okay, and then what about- Look, it's not safe here. You've got to get out. I don't care where you go, whatever. Just find Andrew, take this, and leave. But make sure, promise me, you do not come back here. Thank you. Just be safe. Thank you. 